The Nanex head out on the road for the final time as a member of the CCHA in what will be the most important series of the season. At this point in the season, this is going to be our most important road trip. You know, we've uh, we split with Ohio State last weekend, which is uh, unfortunate. But, you know, they came out Saturday night and, and gave it everything they had. And we just didn't up, end up getting those points, so uh, we need to make up those points in Lake State this weekend. It's, uh, it's huge. All the guys know that. All the coaching staff knows that. So. Uh, we just got to go get the job done. I mean, uh, you look at the standings, one through seven, it's so tight. Uh, anybody could move up any weekend. So, I mean, these last four games of the league play are huge. We got to get points, and then we're going to have to sit and wait and see where we end up. That actually is a big thing. They've got great goaltending. They've had great goaltending all year. The, the, the two games we played up here at the beginning of the year, uh, we split with them, and we outshot them pretty heavily both nights, and their goaltender stood on his head. So. Um, we've obviously got to get pucks to the net, and the, the big thing that Lake State does is they they really pack everybody into the uh, the slot area. And, you know, you'll, there'll be times where you'll watch video and they'll, they'll have all five guys right in the slot there. So we've got to make sure we get bodies through that traffic and get pucks through that traffic. And you know, there's the old saying, you can't stop what you can't see. So if we've got guys, you know, in front of the goalie taking away his eyes, I think we'll be in good shape. And Colton Beck, who recorded his first career hat trick Friday, said they need to execute the game plan in order to have success. Just got to make sure we execute in those tight games because in a month in playoffs, that's a, those are the games we're going to have to win. I think just sticking to the game plan and working hard. I mean, uh, these games we were losing before Christmas were close games, and we came back after Christmas refreshed, came back to work, and I mean, we've just stuck to the game plan, worked hard, uh, done the little things, and we've been successful. So if uh, Keep doing that and have a long playoff run. We got to stick to that game plan. I think uh, you know you talk about last weekend being close uh, like that, but it really it's like that you know every weekend. Even my, in Miami when the when the you know the scores were a little more lopsided at the end of the games, there was still going into the third periods. We we still had chances to win. Uh, same last weekend, you know we you know every weekend we 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 tend to put ourselves in a position to win late in games, and uh, I think that's that's the important part right now. And we've just got to focus on finishing hard.